Yo, what's up, guys? Tavares Media here back with another video. And today we're going to be going over a very special platform called VOCAI. And I really believe that this is a special platform because of its capability and functionality within the AI space. And we're going to be going through it today. We're going to be signing up. We're going to be looking through the platform because I truly believe that this platform is a very good and it's also competing with top platforms like Voice Flow, Bot Press, and it's very beginner friendly. Again, beginner friendly, guys. I'm not saying it's better than these platforms i'm saying it's competing and it's also good for beginners so let's go through it so it's simple as just voc.ai literally that's just the domain and the first thing that i like about this is this right here the the banner join our discord community that's one thing that you don't really see on like other platforms like let's just go on voice flow for comparison again i am not uh, going to be talking down on other platforms. I'm just going to be pointing out what I like about this. So if you see it, there is, it's really hard to find the discord. And I truly believe that the discord community is the most important thing on everything. Why? Because that way you can communicate with others that use the same platform. You can communicate with developers, moderators, and support team. That's the main thing I like about this is that they have the discord on top priority with voice flow. You got to find it. So let's see how long it takes us to find the Discord server. Keep scrolling. Again, if Voice Flow team is watching this, then that's something they can fix on their website. Simple as that. Nothing to talk bad about. Sorry if you hear noise in the background. I'm in the city as well. But yeah, there's a Discord. It's at the bottom of the page, which I don't like that. That means they're not really going to be taking care of the Discord, which is true. The Voice Flow has been known for not very much responding. I think there's only like one. Wait, what? Airtable? Join the voice flow disc. What? Why would I have to? Why do I have to fill out a form just to join the Discord? You see what I'm talking about? Like that I don't like, bro. Like they're trying to get my information, bro. Come on. Like I guess it's a questionnaire, but like do that in the okay, whatever. I like vo VOC. This is why I like this platform more. Okay, so let's go ahead and look through the website. Another thing that I like is right here. Boom. We can talk to a support right here as well. All you have to do is enter your email. Obviously, that's going to be the main thing that you do with anything. Enter your email so you can get an update on your receipt. So, yeah, I like this a lot. You know, it's very community oriented, which I really feel like that's important. Because, again, if you have a very good platform, but it's not community and support oriented, what's the point? Because if you have something that's not working or you need to get in touch with someone or somebody, then you can't do that because there's a lot of uh, issues. And, again, I had to deal with that, like, bad customer uh, orientation with like a credit card that i was calling about today and they're just scummy you know and i really appreciate voc being on top of that so again let's stop the glazing and keep scrolling down just checking out the website just want to show you guys what we're working with and let's look at the features actually i think this is very important so we have reliable reliable ai chatbot okay so we have custom training on your data delivers accurate responses and avoids irrelevant conversations shrouded us intent so this is important intent identification is a, a capability of nlu or mlm right so we're having uh, nlu capabilities and functionality which i think is very important because if you have that on top of large language models that's very key because large language models are very good but they're more free-minded we want intent identification so we can linearize what we want to be able to get communicated through our customers so i like that a lot and let's go ahead and just click demo. I want to see what this is about. Contacts. Okay, so yeah, you just contact the sales. So we're going to go ahead and sign up. I've already signed up. I already have an account, obviously, but you guys can just sign up real quick. And I'm going to go ahead and log in. And again, another thing I like a lot is no credit card required. So that's good. And I'm already logged in. I'm pretty okay. So log me out. Let me just log in real quick, guys. Uh, don't hack me, please. So let me just go ahead and log in real quick. To. Mm, Give me a sec. Okay. Bada bing, bada boom. Should work. And we're in. Perfect. So first thing we're going to be looking at is VOC. We can go to AI chat, chat bot. So let's go in and click that. Because I'm pretty sure this is just the main, like, you know, uh, software functionality. So you have, like, reports. You also have tutorials and stuff. So we can go ahead and check this out. Okay, that's interesting. I don't really know what this is, honestly. Uh... I actually never, I've never been really to figure that out, but let's go to tools and see what we have here. That's really cool. Bro, this is cool. So we have FBA calculator, AI listing, AI assistant, a chat, free chat BG. Okay, what? No, what is this? Whoa, that's cool, bro. They have their own AI chatbot. You see, bro, this is what I like, okay? I like this. AI assistant, 
Okay, this is a really cool platform, guys. I'm really liking this. So there's a lot of functionality in this. So I guess this is just the VOC side. So it's VOC dot AI. So it has AI and it has all the more functional things. So we have social listening, market insight, review analysis. Let's go ahead and check out the AI chatbot side, which is very important. That's what we're here to make money with. So the first thing I want to see is, okay, we have inbound lead detection agent. That's what we created. So let's look at the agent introduction where, where we type out and we build our prompting. So we have, you are an inbound lead detection agent customer support. Your business brand is inbound lead. Okay, so we already have it. This is preset. This is what I typed in. Okay, we have a task description. Same thing as uh, AI prompting. Let's go to our knowledge base where we can add our knowledges. So we can go ahead and click add knowledge. So that's, that's, that's this is what I add in my last building of this bot so you can add links you can also add document learning you can also add a q and a library so this right here is like the mlm this is the mlu so you can build like a uh a, a, a q and a library so you can ask like okay so let's say a frequently asked question is um what time can I talk to the owner at? And then you would add that there because that's something that the large language model would be able to compute. So this is more just additional computation. So we have competence right here, e-commerce logistics message. So I'm pretty sure this is uh, just more competent. So it's making sure that the bot is more competent. So that's good. System integration, I'm pretty sure this is API. Yeah, that's what I said. Live chat, so you can go ahead and embed live chat. So this is how you would embed it. So what you would do is you copy this integration code and you put it into the HTML of your website, like the body or the header, whatever. And then you also have APIs. So you can do custom APIs as well. So you would turn this on and pretty much add your custom APIs, whether you're making a custom one or using a preset one. So that's good. And then this is where stuff gets very fun and advanced. Intent and uh, ident identification. So this is like utterances and etc. So you have intent. So if this is where the functionality gets in. So let's say with voice flow per se, you would want to create an intent. So let's say I want to trigger a certain node. So let's say I want to cancel an order. So this would trigger a certain node in voice flow and you would have to do a whole bunch of stuff. So this is the intent. So custom request to cancel an order. So again, you would use this in any kind of logistics for whatever your bot details, whether it's an Airbnb bot, an e-commerce bot, it doesn't matter. That's what it's for. And let's go to smart inbox. So this is important as well. I'm pretty sure that this is allows you to use and control the AI bot simultaneously while letting the AI talk. So let's say you're in a live conversation, you can literally start typing and making sure that the AI bot, so you can literally watch and monitor a live conversation. So you could say, hey, to the customer live while uh, I'm talking to the AI bot on the other side. So that's really cool. I really like that a lot. You do not see that on other platforms. And uh, yeah, guys, let's go ahead and just talk to this bot, ask anything. Again, it's very simple. Let's just say, hey, and let's see what it says. Sorry if you hear the train in the background, guys. It's really annoying. Hello there. How can I sell? Okay, so boom. There you go, guys. So it's already working. And that's just a pretty much simple. And I'm pretty sure I can go back to Smart Inbox and see that. And look right there. So that's really cool. And I can click talk to the client and say something back to them. So we can say, hey. And we can go back to configure and test and it would be there but obviously it resets it because it's not live so as you can see it resets it but on the live conversation it would actually be there so this is really cool guys and i really really like this platform guys i hope you guys check it out let's go ahead and look at the pricing chart so if we have we have free right now i would definitely just focus on free obviously and i'm pretty sure you can get more messages per month and then as you work your way up you can get a hundred dollars to four five hundred dollars a month so yeah guys i really recommend checking this platform out i really like it a lot and i will leave it in the description below again let me know what you guys think sign up on it let me know what you guys think and that's it guys i hope you guys enjoyed the video love you all so much and again another thing i'm gonna check out is tutorial as well so you have tutorials we should also check that out so we go to resources and you have all the resources here is like knowledge right here so you can learn and see how you guys can use this platform better which is also very important so we have the user manual right here so this is also very important guys i hope you guys enjoy this video and i'll catch you guys in the next one see you guys later